Trace Trolco, Sons of UCF, another spring game in the books. While there will be a lot to clean up, head coach Gus Malzahn and players say they like what they've accomplished during this spring camp. Played a half of football, uh, let everybody play. It was good. There was some good, some things that do a bit better. Bottom line, our guys were hustling. Overall, you look at it, you know, from head coach's standpoint, we had a really good spring. Uh, you know, we, we held R.J. Harvey out. We didn't get him tackled during the, the spring, but he did a lot of good things in practice. Non-tackle, uh, Kobe Hudson. He got banged up early in the fall, you know, uh, the spring. We gave some other guys some opportunities. Uh, there were a few explosive plays. Uh, you know, we were trying to throw it. It was windy, pretty windy out there. But, uh, you know, watched a little bit of the Masters today. I think it was pretty similar, right? There. It was kind of hard to throw the deep ball, but overall, you saw our defense being a lot more aggressive. Uh, did some really good things offensively. Did some good things. I thought our quarterbacks, you know, going live. Obviously, KJ. Wasn't live. The other guys really made some plays with their feet at time. I think it's really good for a defense too. Anytime a quarterback can go live, and you know, if you let KJ go live, it's a different story with that. But I said overall pleased. Uh, I was just being consistent. Uh, it doesn't matter that I'm trying to focus on remaining. Uh, just focusing each and every day. I step on the field. It's my approach each and every day. Uh, approach to get better. Approach to be elite. And uh, so just being consistent that brings along with being. You know, it was a lot of fun. Uh, I had. I had a um, chance to get in the end zone, so that was big time for me, just, just being able to contribute to um, the situation I was in. So it's been the most important thing you think your defense has accomplished over the course of this spring? You know, just really getting our identity probably more than anything. I mean, this aggressive attacking style, they're flying around, they're having fun. Uh, you know, there's you know, the veterans we brought in and played a lot of football too. And our guys that have played two years, they're starting to grow up, and they're different than they were last year. So really it's a combination of both. It's just uh, uh, a confident defense, that's probably the best way that I can put it. You guys can hit. You guys come down here. You guys come down here. I mean, that's what you want to see from a defense, guys flying around, uh, rallying to the ball, all 11 hats getting to the ball. So, I mean, that's what you want to see from a defense, those guys flying around and they got the pass popping out. That's what I mean. It, it's all good just being able to see those guys just fly around and uh, also just ball skills and things of that nature too. So they do some really good things on this side of the ball. We'll have a complete recap of the spring game on Thursday, Sons of UCF Live. The next time the Knights are in the bounce house in a competitive game is when they welcome in New Hampshire on Thursday, August 29th. For the Sons of UCF, I'm Trace Troll.